Este rapero fría a dos amigos suyos e intentó hacer creer a todos que habían sido víctimas de un... Pero su extraño comportamiento en el juicio dejó más que claro que ni siquiera intentaría demostrar su inocencia. Jamel Demons, más conocido por todos como YNW Melly, fue detenido en 2018 como principal sospechoso de tiros a dos amigos suyos tras una sesión de grabación. Y es que, según el rapero y su cómplice, habían sido atacados desde un vehículo en marcha que se habría dado a la fuga. Tras el suceso, YMW Melly llevó rápidamente a las víctimas al hospital, pero ya no había nada que hacer, puesto que ambos al llegar. El rapero aseguró ser inocente de todos los cargos, por lo que decidió entregarse a la policía sin ningún tipo de reparo. First thing you are going to hear is that at 4.35 a.m. on October 26th of 2018, Cortland Henry, a co-defendant, shows up at Memorial Miramar Hospital. In his car, he has two... In the front passenger seat is Anthony Williams. In the rear passenger seat is Christopher Thomas. They are... They are riddled with bullets, and the car is full of... Christopher Thomas is sitting in the rear. There is multiple defects to his body. Anthony Williams, who is sitting in the front, has two major injuries. Officer Jessica Amangor is working a detail at the hospital. Cortland Henry runs in, starts telling a story about a drive-by. Pero pese a que su juicio ha estado repleto de ambigüedades y vacíos y ha sido pospuesto en varias ocasiones, YNW Melly ha evitado dar su testimonio sobre lo que sucedió realmente ese día, lo que llamó excesivamente la atención del jurado. I don't know uh, what discussion you had with uh, your attorneys. You've got a competent lawyer here, and you've seen them perform here, and you've discussed them with them, I assume, correct? Yes, sir. And you understand that uh, you have a right to testify, and you also have a right not to testify. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Do you understand that if you do testify, I'm going to instruct the jury that they have to consider your testimony as they would any other witness. You understand that? Yes, sir. And if you don't testify, I'm going to instruct the, 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 the jury that you have a right not to testify, and they can't consider that, hold that against you. You understand that? Yes, sir. So my question, I guess, is, uh, is did you have enough time to talk about this issue about you testifying or not testifying? Uh, did you have enough time to discuss that with your attorneys? Yes, sir. Did they answer all your questions? Yes, sir. And uh, what is your decision? I will not be testified. You will not be testified. Yes, sir. Is anyone forcing you or coercing you to make this decision? No, sir. Anybody make any promises or, or, 
I'm not going to make any threats uh, to get you not to testify. Yes, sir. This is your free and voluntary decision. Yes, sir. Y es que gran parte de la evidencia apuntaba a Demons como culpable, pero al rapero tampoco le interesó llevar a testigos de calidad que realmente pudieran dar fe de que él no era responsable de lo sucedido. So you you smoke a lot of, right? You smoke it anytime you get a chance. I think is how you phrase it. It's your answer. Yeah. That was your answer. I smoke when I smoke. You smoke when you smoke? Yeah. And when's that? When I smoke. And when was that? When I smoke. How many times a day? Objection to ask me answer. Hold rule. Twice, three times, maybe. Okay. And on the night in Before you got to the studio, um, on the day in question, you had smoked at least two, right? I sure guess. That's what you said, right? I don't recall. Okay. And when you got to the studio, you were smoking, correct? Possibly. Were you already? It was five years ago. You forget? I don't recall. Okay. And. You were drinking Hennessy, I believe, or do you not recall that either? It's possible. Possible. But you don't recall? I don't. Okay. So you don't recall much from that night, do you? Right? Fair? Right. Did you smoke before you came here today? I did not. Okay. I have nothing. Thank you. I should have. Finalmente, el jurado no logró llegar a una decisión unánime, por lo que el juez decidió anular el juicio y reagendó uno nuevo para octubre, en el cual se sabrá su sentencia final y si tendrá o no que enfrentarse a la pena de...